great day to go picking. Getting out here kind of late today, but I have something specific that I'm after. I'm gonna go park in here this week, give myself a little bit shorter walk. Cause I got a lot of stuff I gotta grab. Hey, four by four. One cloud, it's about 82 out. Hot. Coming in from the backside. Well, packed with vendors, but not really packed with people. A lot of stuff to look at. I'm gonna skip row one today. I'm gonna go all the way down here, get what I'm looking for. I think I'm on the wrong aisle. Gotta cut over. Already pack up a lot of the buildings? No, nope, I haven't even started on it. Except for one. I had some buildings out here last week that had, it looked like, well, I guess this is it right here. There's that one, that one, and the red one. These are HO. The HO. Ones are HO. All right, I'm going to get some of these from you. Oh. Let me get this one. Do you have any little figures like this, the little people? Uh, I know little. I have them at home, but I'm not sure. Do you? You for HO stuff? Yeah, because I'm going to do a Hot Wheels uh, scenic track, and I, I kind of want to use some train scenery for it. Okay. Um, next week, we're going to be inside. Oh, will yeah. But okay. I'll bring some HO buildings. Okay. I'm going to get this one from you also. Okay. Is it okay to lift it there? Yeah, should be. What is this? I was going to ask I you. I think it's supposed to be like a concrete plant or something. I'm concrete sure. plant. Okay. That's for HO? Yes. There's a house I saw last week. How about this one? No, I don't Hello, think that's... What scale is that? That's a big scale. It's also scale. HO. Is it? Mm -hmm. Is this a set? Yes. How much is that one? The yellow box of the Yeah. 50. Huh? 50. Make it offer. Is this HO? Yes. Oh, HO? Yeah. Before we put them on some medicine. These are N scale, right? Right. I like the N scale. We've got all sorts of different cars, grand scale, a bunch of buildings, and lots of track. Inside. Anything over here that's HO that I'm not seeing? Uh, other than the red building. Besides no. that red building. I believe everything else is in scale. I said I'll bring HO buildings next week. Okay. There you go, guys. Got all this stuff for 50 bucks. I've got a nice scenic track in mind. Got to start putting together the pieces. I think this was the other guy that's got houses and stuff. Let's go see. Hey, bud. Did you have the uh, little houses for train sets and stuff last week? Yeah. Did you? Do you have those out still? Uh, no. Okay. Uh, I don't know where they're at. Day three, but uh, I'll be back next Wednesday. Yeah, I, ju I just bought a, a, a couple of states this week. Uh -huh. And they went on top of everything that was already on the trailer, so... Okay. okay. Yeah, I just got myself a bunch of little train set. Oh, uh, okay. Houses and all that, all right. so that's what I'm looking for. Yeah, no problem. All right, man, appreciate it. Thanks, buddy.
That's all right. We'll, uh, we'll come back out next week. They're going to be inside. So in the big building over here where the AC is. We'll be able to take our time and look through some stuff. Beautiful day to go picking. Getting a nice early start. It's about 82 degrees already. Let's go see what we find. Coming in from the opposite side this week. Hey, look. Corvette. Nice. We never park on this side. Seems to be the side you park on when you want to come and get vegetables and leave. Saved a spot right up front. It's a little chaotic when you come out here to find parking, but don't park like this guy. How's that bank gonna get out? Come on. Been coming out here for eight years. Never came in this way. walking between a very old building and a newer one. I think we're going to go inside this one first. Maybe because I always forget to check in here. Vendors in building. Exhibit hall. This is where the train guy was going to be with the scenery. Hey, how you doing? Hello. I'm the guy with the asking for the HO buildings. Yeah, brought lots of them. Yeah, I see that. All right. There's a couple of pretty cool ones. There's a movie theater, and then right next to the movie theater is a funeral home. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah. This is the movie theater, and this one is the theater home, which I thought was kind of cool. Yeah, that is cool. All right. How, how many do you have total at per HO scale? Uh, yeah, one, two, three. Are all these HO as well? Yes. Uh, these two, I believe, are HO. We only have very little of the end stuff left. Mm, okay, that's fine. Yeah, Is this like an apartment building or something? Yeah, it's, it's supposed to be glued together and this last piece came apart. Gotcha. Uh, what is this thing here? It's, it's some kind of a... Um, where the trains pull in? Where the trains pull in. Yeah. All right, I'm going to get this one. Okay. That one. Is this also HL? Yes. Okay. Well, that one almost looks like a Howard Johnson's. It does kind of, yeah. All right, let me add this up. So we're 10, 8, 8, 16, so 26. Here's some apartment buildings over here also. Okay. Right, let me see. just run these things to the truck and go back in and look for a few hot wings. Not really walking roads this week, walking through the grass. Coming over to Big Man from the opposite side. See if we can find some six for five here. And so, you know what that means.
got myself quite a few Hot Wheels, but I'm tapped out. So we'll have to come back out next week and continue the process. One video for you guys, three weeks of picking for me. Back out picking. Third week for me, same video for y'all. I need to find myself a place to park. Clouds are moving in quick today. Flag's barely moving. Let's go see what we find. It forecasted rain this morning, so looks like a lot of vendors did not show up. See the difference. Usually a bunch of vendors right over here, corner of the first row. And a whole bunch of people here. Oh well. Oh, oh, oh. Only in Florida do you have puddles and it hasn't rained yet. Big man's out here. All right, six for five. And we're going to go over to my own music. Go, so, 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 There not being hardly anybody here. We still found Hot Wheels. Any Hot Wheels hiding down in here? Now for some water. Okay. Hey guys, this will give us a chance to look at what else is available at the market. Old school desk. Skateboards. What are they? And cheap ones. That's pretty cool. So is this. Florida Gators. Hey, I use these in my Halloween video. I don't know how much you want for that. I can stand off from afar. See, there's nothing over here. Keep it moving. Weather predicted it'd be raining, so nobody showed up. Well, not all hope is lost because we're going to go inside, see if my friend with the scenery is in there. My friend with the train sets is in here. Any more of the uh remember i was talking to you about that the houses the scenery last week uh-huh um no i haven't I, I i don't i don't think i have it on the truck today 
Good way to go, dollars. I got like all a uh, whole new load today, so. Oh, do you? Probably not. How much you got on this, bud? Anything on that table is 50 cents, sir. 50 cents? Three per buck. Per all right. 50 cents as well. So, not bad. These things over here. What's that? Good way to go, All right, guys. We're over here by the vegetables and fruits. So, good time to call it quits. Go home and see what we got. Got a little bit. Back home. Let me get this table cleared off. We have an entire city to build. Not going to go in any particular order here, but start off with this one. Neat looking little industrial building. Always love getting these handmade dioramas. You can tell they used a pill, a pill bottle, and painted it. Look at this homemade dumpster. This was part of a cool train set, I guess. Once upon a time. Of course, we got our people leaning up against the wall, taking a break. A little loading dock. That's really neat. Look at that, even the water main. Very cool. And another one here. Look at this. Not sure what this is. Maybe some sort of grain plant or I don't know what. You can use your imagination. I'm sure some of you train hobbyists will tell me that's supposed to be this, that, or the other. But for me, just a bunch of cool buildings. And little by little, we'll start making our industrial park. Look at this thing. Maybe like another loader area. Look at this, very cool. <laughs> Definitely use little bottles and painted them. That is too neat. Ten bucks for somebody's handmade thing. That's a steal. And some more traditional HO buildings. This one was five bucks. Neat little building. You can see if we just add it to the side here, it adds another dimension to our diorama. And this one. Probably part of a Tyco set or something. Looks like it actually works. Hook that up and the loader comes forward, loads up your train, probably backs up. Pretty neat. Where can we put this one? Maybe right here. And maybe right there. Do it like that. And cool little house. be off in the corner here by itself this I thought was the coolest one got some paint peeling off of these pill bottles but it's all right I can repaint them touch them up a bit I think the more decrepit these things look the better they are stick that one off in the corner here so just like that we've got a nice little industrial park going Keep it going with our buildings here. This one, I agree with the guy. Reminds me of a Howard Johnson's. Go right in the front door. Looks like somebody was standing outside but left their shoes. Look at this. Got a little hedge. Roadside in. <laughs> That's cool. Look at that little area in the back. You take a break. Trash cans. Hey, you guys know what that is? That's a phone booth. How many of those do you see nowadays? Where's a good spot? Oh, we got a giant spider in town crawling across the tracks. 
Howard Johnson's on the outskirts of town here. Right over there. Then we have the Scala apartment building. Another cool one. I like the interior just plain like that. Makes it look like it's part of a ghost town. That's a little hint for what's coming up on Ghost Jerker. Ghost town. Which is why I'm picking all this stuff up. Don't tell anybody. Then we have this giant, what I think is the coolest thing. A little broken apart, but we'll fix that. Big apartment building. Check out the air conditioned units. Little shops down below. Missing some railing, but I think I saw the railing with it, so somewhere in this box we've got railing. Some windows busted out. No sense in trying to bring these back up to new again. They're gonna be part of ghost town, so they need to look vacated and just uh, run down. Hold on, let me rearrange this city. Just like that, we've got it rearranged with some streets. <laughs> Who knows how the final version of Ghost Town will look, but for right now, in the sake of this video, just setting up something real quick. There's another cool building. Look at this thing. These are HO scale, so probably a little bit smaller than 164 scale, but nonetheless, it works. Check this out with the shops down below. That's really neat. It's on this side. And in the front door, on display, Too cool. Of course, you got your penthouse up here. Even the rooftop looks realistic. And we got this long one. Look at this. More shops. This is awesome. I always wanted to do a train set as a kid. Once upon a time, I had a giant slot car track set up in my garage. Pretty realistic. Long before my YouTube days. So, it's already been taken down and taken apart, but man, I love those times. Having a realistic track set up. This is a really cool one. The movie theater. They're showing African Queen. Starts Monday. Buy your tickets now. Probably an apartment building upstairs where the guy that runs the movie theater lives. And probably the coolest building. We're all gonna get there one day. Look at that. Funeral home. Gonna be neat to park a purse out front all on the side of the building and this thing kind of looks like a maybe a firehouse or something let's give our streets a little bit more room all right there you have it guys instant town ghost town Now we'll take a look at some cars. Oh, almost forgot one. Nice little country style home. Opens up at the top here. It's a little wooden house. Not quite as realistic as the rest, but put it right down here next to the Howard Johnsons. Now onto some cars. Starting with a number 94 Mac tonight car. Cool NASCAR. 
There's a cool one. Number 29, WCW car. World Championship Wrestling. Those were the days. Number 63, Tracy Leslie. That's Lysol car. And Jeff Green in the number 29 Cartoon Network car. Get that double lot, Aqua Fresh, Buckshot Jones. Next up, we got a number two, DuPont car. A lot of some older Hot Wheels, Double Vision. Love this one. 57 Chevy. Star Spangled colorway. Very neat. Now, oh, look, another spider. Where are these spiders coming from? Forgot to show you guys the back of some of these. Look at this. Goes with our theme today. Building their own city. What was on the back of this one? Oh, cool, the bio. Got a customized C3500. Love that when they do a dually with a single wide tire in the back. Hey, get a free car through the Hot Wheels Birthday Club. Not sure if that's still a thing or not. Here we have the beautiful 1936 Cord. Looks like it should be parked outside of the front of this movie theater. Going to see the African Queen. Dropped off in luxury. Here we have a catapult. Cool little race car. Mercedes C Class. It's a nice one. I picked up a few of these from Big Man on different days. Here we have an Olds 442. Nice white. 58 vet convertible of that chrome interior stick shift car side pipes here Ford truck with raft police vehicle that's neat wonder if that raft comes off of there I'll have to open it someday to find out here we have a 67 Pontiac GTO. Crazy looking hippie stuff on the side. C4 Corvette. Silver flames. I've got this car in the orange colorway, but I don't think it has flames on it, so that's cool to see. And of course, it's got the little luggage in the back. Tough to see in there, but it's there. Hey, another race car. Chaparral 2. Camaro Z28. Another patriotic one. 68 El Camino. Nice pearlescent paint job. Let's see if I can put these in the sunlight a little better. Let's get our angle better. Now we can get them in the sunlight just in time because we have the 65 and Powell Lowrider. That is a beautiful car. Awesome purple paint, pinstripes. Look at that, nice green Dodge pickup. Too bad that blister is so dirty or we can see how pretty that paint is. There's a nice purple 67 Pontiac GTO. That's awesome. Look at the flame job on that thing. Pink flames. And look at that 67 Dodge Charger. Really neat. Got another NASCAR here. 
Number 35, Tabasco. Who is that? Todd Bodine. Super modified. Birthday club. <laughs> I mean, see, this is why I don't show the back of cards because I forget to do it. We'll just go through these real quick. Habits, man, habits. Hard to break. I won't show them all to you, but here's the Hero City fan. One day I'll dedicate a video to showing the front and back. Make it a point. Oh, look at that. It's got it in all the different languages. That's really neat. There we have the Porsche. Oh, no, that's not a Porsche. Cruise Whale Tail. Kind of made to look like a Porsche, but cartoon version. And there you go. More cruise stuff. Some more Hero City. The Race Grooves. Chevy Avalanche. Wonder if Race Groove still has his. To the rescue, Chevy Avalanche. Pretty neat. Got yeah, another one of these. Same exact car, I think. Where is the other one? There it is. Well, maybe a little different color. No, maybe not. Pretty much the same cars. There's a shiny one. The Cockney Cab 2. Not sure what the Cockney Cab 1 looks like. Can't remember. There's something patriotic. 65 Mustang convertible. Stars and Stripes, flame job. And the Kaboom Pro Stock Firebird. I'm sure a lot of these cars will be making their way to a King of the Hill soon. Look at that, track tune. It's actually pretty cool. This could be a real tuner car these days. This one's got an x-ray body. Nice purple color. Wolfers in the back. Got on the back. Ah, fun facts. Did you know there are two planes in the Hot Wheels line? Look for Mad Props, introduced in 2004, and the Poison Arrow, introduced in 2005, to be included in a five-pack in 2006. Somebody out there knows all that useless information by heart. I admit I used to know quite a bit of it. Now I'm a little bit... I don't know what I am. See? I forgot. Hero City, PT Cruiser. We've got a Fiat 500 set up for the drag strip. This big wing on the back. Pretty rowdy. This looks like it'll be fast on track. Nitro Scorcher. Low slung. And onto the coolest stuff. Got some funny cars for an upcoming funny car king of the hill. This is the rubber tire batch. So we got a Kendall rubber tires. There's an Otter Pops with rubber tires. Pretty neat. I like the Munsters. And Pioneer car. Three for five bucks. Man. I almost got that deal. Not quite. Another rubber tire car. Sentry. Same stuff on the back. These ought to be fast. These are not rubber tires. Fast orange. Plastic wheels and tires. That's a neat one. Same stuff on the back. Back a little bit. Rug Doctor. Plastic wheels and tires. 
same stuff on the back of all these. Western Auto. Another Century car in green. That's cool. This is awesome. King of the Burnouts. That is really cool. And a Pioneer car. And last up, Kendall car. Got a Kendall car before, right? Yeah. So there you go. Rubber tire Kendall and a plastic tire. Pretty neat. All right, guys, that'll do it. Got some pretty awesome cars. Took three weeks to get them, but it's all right. I was out there for something else. These things. Built ourselves a little city, a little town. Look at that. Pretty awesome. Can't wait to see what I'm going to do with this stuff. All right, guys. Hope you find what you're looking for out there. Happy picking to all. Take care. <laughs> Not sure if that's a delivery or a pickup.